Hello and welcome to Eleven's proposal to engage engineering leaders across various campuses to assist them in making meaningful contributions to their community. As a team of five, we range from three different universities across the nation. Two of our members are from Cal Poly Pomona in California, Amber Thomas and Keeley Rainey. Two of our members are from the University of Texas at El Paso, Najee Martinez Shabazz and Magdalena Guillen. And our final member is from James Madison University in Virginia, Jacqueline Ritterford. While we were separated location-wise, we came together as a team to form what you all know now as Eleven. As a team, we came together three times a week over the span of two weeks, meeting over Zoom and discussing fundamentals of our task. We also messaged frequently on GroupMe, and it's important to note that from three different time zones, we were able to communicate effectively and accommodate our meeting times accordingly. Because we are living the situation as we speak, we decided to place our focus on collegiate engineering students. Due to the abundance of experience we had as a team, we were able to combine our knowledge and deliver an effective solution to the need we sought to solve. Our combined knowledge additionally assisted us in identifying an imminent need amongst engineering leaders across the nation. We specifically decided to apply our design to engineering students who'd like to have a comfortable setting to gain technical skills in their specified field outside of the classroom also practice effective communication and explore the basic fundamental skills needed to promote their work and themselves. We also wanted to provide sufficient information about their career options that are available and thus assist them in landing a job once their collegiate education is complete. In fact, 53% of college graduates are either underemployed or unemployed, which we hope to decrease. Our overarching problem statement is that many engineering students struggle to gain the essential skills and experience they'd like to have before entering the workforce. Some claim to not have enough time to participate in these extra events, while others don't know where to begin or feel inadequate to apply their knowledge to a career-driven project. We are addressing this through our goal that in an inclusive environment, engineering leaders will have a new opportunity to gain leadership skills, effective communication, varying experience in their technical field of study while applying problem-solving application, simultaneously receiving the benefits of learning about the inner workings of a company, as well as developing their social competence. We plan to collaborate with companies to host a competition to solve a real-life applicable need, which we are planning to achieve in two simple steps. The first part of each event will be an info session and a meet and greet. Any engineering students can show up to this part of the event, no preparation is needed. The company will first identify how they complete business and how they carry on internally within their corporation. Mentioning a real-life applicable problem, they will then explain the competition rules. Once this is complete and students understand the expectations and what is required of them, they can choose to sign up. The second part of the event will be the competition. Whether as an individual or in a group, students will work together to solve the specified problem and present it to the company. After the competition, the company will pick a winner and provide a monetary prize. The company will also explain their reasoning on choosing the winning design and its applicability in the workplace. Much of this is applied in our value proposition canvas. Since we've already spoken of our desired plan and the actions that accompany such a project, I will briefly dive into the two sections. As stated before, we will assist students in creating relationships with companies displaying their talents at a professional level. Students have a chance to experience what a real-world company does daily, meet an exciting challenge, and ultimately create networking connections that will satisfy their job seeking after graduation. This will add to their undergraduate experience. While students may be worrisome about deadlines and the emotions that accompany a pressure-sensitive competition, it will last no longer than a weekend, which is entailed in our value proposition of the canvas. The competition will create a mutually beneficial relationship for both company and student that sponsor community projects applicable in the real world. It's imperative that the students recognize the willingness of a company to sponsor such competitions, seeking talent amongst the engineering leaders in their community. Financial relief will additionally act as a pain reliever to students, which is also an incentive to complete such projects. A student can only gain from partaking in this competition. Our value proposition canvas is linked in the description box below if you wish to further read what we've provided. While there are other ways to build these skills and connections, this would give students a place to start and a sense of community. While many colleges also have info sessions which are great to learn about the companies, it can be impersonal and not give students a well-rounded picture of the company. Being able to have an info session and then work with a company will give students a lot more information about the real world, the community-wide problems they are trying to solve, and more face-to-face -face time with the working individuals, given the circumstances permit. 
the connections that can be made will be beneficial for engineering leaders in the long run. We appreciate your time in listening to our proposal. Once again, this is Eleven, seeking to engage engineering leaders across campuses and making meaningful contributions to their community.